Another episode of What's Next Podcast. I'm your host, Mario Maitland. We got a very special guest on for today, Miss Masai Russell, coming on What's Next Podcast to talk a little bit about her journey and that what's next. Since she's on What's Next, we're going to talk about what's next, what's coming up next for you. A little bit about uh, who you are as a person outside of track and field. What are some things and interests or uh, passions, I guess, that you have outside the sport? Yeah, so I'm really passionate about like content creation, influencing, influencing those who are younger than me yeah. or older than me. You know, if you go on my Instagram, my TikTok, I like to dance, take pictures. So that's a little bit about the things that I like to do, like off the track. The of course. Do you call yourself an entertainer? Because I know you, you're an influencer, but a lot of people think you're entertaining as well. So, well, I don't know. Do you call yourself an entertainer? I mean, I guess in a way. You go <laughs> to my TikToks, you get entertained. You For see sure. the dances, you see what I do. So, For sure. In a way, but put me in front of a large crowd, I'm not doing nothing. You're not doing it? No. Okay, that's fine. We won't do that. That's why we're not doing yeah. that on What's Next Podcast. <laughs> Walk me through a day in the life of Masai Russell. What, what, what does that look like for your fans, for anybody who looks up to you? What does that look like for you? Um, for me, it looks like wait till the morning, probably take a little nap in between, mm -hmm. practice, edit some videos, record some stuff, yeah. talk to somebody, yeah. um, chill, my man. Yeah, you know, I and it. Yeah, like I said, go to practice. I'll be in practice for like four hours out of the day and then, you know, go home, get in my like, up. It's a lot of a lot of work that you got to put in, of course. And then you got your time to rest up and, and get, uh, you have a really good uh, work balance, I guess. Work-life balance, put in the work and then enjoy, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, outside yeah. time. And you're just coming from Austin, Texas and had a successful run down there. Well, what's, what's uh, I guess, favorite moment as a Wildcat? Wow, that's a hard question because I've had a lot of great moments. Man. But one of the major moments that I have to say is when I was a freshman um, and I ran like an 818 in the 60 hurdles and that was like a major PR for me. And I yeah. went back to the tent okay. and all my teammates were so happy for me. Like they were more happy than me. And I was just really big for me because in high school That's I wasn't able up. to like talk about my success. So but to see like, like teammates that are genuinely happy man. for you, that really, really was like a major impactful thing I like, bet. in my college career. I bet. As I, I want to get into your your mind a little bit. As a, uh, you're going into the meet, you know, uh, a general meet, you have any uh, superstitions or pre-rituals that you do? Nah, no, I just no. know. That, like, <laughs> That's what's up. It's, That's what's up. The only thing I know is go. So I it ain't you. nothing no, nothing added to the pie that yeah. I need to add. For you sure. Know? For sure. Now, you're, you're also known as the queen hurdle. You got a, you got a nice hurdle right here for me, which I'm going to have you teach me a little bit about hurdling and, and before I even get my actual trying, what are some things I, ha I must do so I don't trick this up? This is Masai Russell from the University of Kentucky, and what she just achieved is absolutely insane. At the 2023 Red Raider Open in Texas Tech, she just ran the fastest time in NCAA history in the women's 60 meter hurdles, breaking the previous collegiate record by 0 .03 seconds. With a finishing time of 7.75 seconds, she not only improved on her own personal record by more than a tenth of a second, but she also just became the 12th fastest indoor performer in the history of this event, now comparable with some of the greatest athletes in the history of athletics. When you're approaching the hurdle, don't don't bend your legs, nothing. Like go over it like with well, I don't know which one's your which what's your strong leg? I, I guess my right leg. I mean I'm not sure I never did this, so Okay, so alright. So first I'm just gonna push you. Okay. Okay, stand straight. All right. Stand straight. Both of your feet together. Okay, so you're so I'm walking. This is your this is gonna be your lead leg. Oh uh, boy, I don't like that. Uh, it feels a little weak. See so it's gonna feel like that, but that's the leg that's your strong leg, because that's okay. the leg that you use to stop yourself. Okay. So well, actually, actually, do whatever's comfortable for you. All right, you said that, so I'm going to do it. <laughs> but like I said, make sure your leg is straight when you're approaching it. Okay. And then the trail leg is the most important leg. Trail this, leg? This leg going to get over, but the trail leg, you got to make sure that it clears that hurdle. So I want to get this over and then make sure I yeah, bring, like, bring, bring this some baggage around. around. I, yeah, got like, I got you. I got you. Bring it around town. All right, you got <laughs> You got to let me know how I do here, okay? Don't judge me. Don't judge me. I'm stressed today. This is going over. This is coming. Okay. Oh, did I do it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. All right, you try. Do it. I think I'm in fucking basketball mode. So this is going over and then this is coming. Coming through like, I got you. I got you. 
Here we go. Here we go. That was better than the last time. Hey, we'll, but we'll you, take it. I mean, that's better than the other one. You kind of went through it. But okay. you still was like okay. straddled over the hurt. You can see that I got a uh, progress. I'm getting some progress. Yeah. Here. I got some potential. One more. One more. Third time you charm. All right. All right. You said get my, get my last yeah, come leg. Come on. Drive it through. Run through it. Break some speed. <laughs> Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that wasn't that bad. That really? wasn't that bad. He didn't do bad. He didn't do that bad. I, 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 got, I got a step back, ladies and gents, but it's okay, man. It's not about me. It's about Masai Russell today. So don't don't judge me on that last hurdle. We're gonna talk about Masai Russell and her journey and what she got coming up next. So stay tuned.